Hi everybody, it's Peter here at Precision Fit Golf. Hope you're all keeping well. Into the first week in April now, and the first major is approaching soon next week with the Masters. So the golf season is officially underway. Uh, one of the first fitting systems we've got in uh, this week is the new Cleveland system. So we had a lesson last night, guy playing off two handicap. Guy th couldn't think of anyone better to actually try out the new driver. So first impressions are, like I said, the club head. As you look at it, you see it's on. It's got a lovely matte finish to the club head. Slightly wider profile from heel to toe, and like I said, it's a nice triangular shape with a weight towards the back. So obviously, this is all about sort of high MOI, and the club head is going to be stable. So it's designed for maybe the mid to the higher handicap golfer. With the stock shafts that they're offering, like I said, they create a little bit more spin. But then we were back into the wind last night, so I think once again, it's probably aimed at slightly slower club head speeds. Guys who are trying to create a bit of sort of maximum carry and get the ball out there. One thing that impressed me about the driver though last night was um, the ball speed. Like I said, it was a cold evening and the client was only started swinging between 99 and 102. But like I said, weather being a little bit cold, we weren't going to be generating a whole lot of club head speed last night. But the one thing that stood out even for 99 miles an hour was that the club head speed was quite phenomenal. Like I said, 143 to 144, that's pretty good uh, considering, like I said, as um, for the Cleveland driver, like I said, they wouldn't have been out there in the past. They're sort of renowned for wedges and what have you. But like I said, the fact that they're now owned by the Strixon company, you're seeing an awful lot of quality and a lot of the technology from the Strixon company itself is finding its way into the Cleveland products. You know what I mean? So in the weeks ahead, what we're going to do is we're going to try uh, the driver again. What we're do is we're going to put a couple of other shafts in to see if we can improve the numbers a little bit further. But I think people are going to be um, really impressed with the new Cleveland driver. We'll also have information about the halo irons and some of the other irons and fairway woods that are coming on stream in the next week or two from Cleveland. Uh, so thanks very much for watching like i said is check out like i said in a couple of weeks we'll see if we can put some more data up about it. i think you're going to be well impressed with the new cleveland driver i think it's really really good